Hello and welcome to Mr. Kuchma's guide on how to use the app called Cam Scanner. Uh, it's a great little tool that uh, utilizes your smartphone's camera to be able to scan documents and turn them into PDFs, which is what we as online teachers mark. So I've already downloaded the app, um, but if I go to open, it will take me here to the Cam Scanner. And we are going to start a new document. Now, as you can see, I already made one, um, but uh, I want to do a video to show you how to use it. So in that bottom right corner is the camera button. If I press that, it takes me to my camera. And now I can take a picture of my assignment. I printed this one off of my course, Algebra Assignment 1. What's nice is that it auto crops it. Um, and then you hit the check mark in the bottom right corner, which is nice. On this bottom screen, it's going to have a couple different options for you to choose from. Uh, black and white, magic color, um, and then original. Uh, depending on if you need color in your scanning, um, will determine whether or not you should use magic color or black and white. Um, this one's all black and white for this assignment, so I can use this function. And then once you've chosen, in the bottom right corner is the check mark, and you click that. Now, you can um, uh, add additional pages to your PDF by hitting the camera function again in the bottom right corner. So I'm going to flip past this one. I'm going to show you an interesting feature as well. So if I'm going to see if I can, if I have uh, multiple documents, sometimes it will. Oh, no, it's still auto cropped. Um, so it's still auto cropped. That's great. Uh, check mark in the bottom right corner. Let's see if I can get it to do it in the second second one. Okay, so I go to page three. Um, if, let's go like this, if they're like really close like that, so obviously the pages are close, um, and I hit the button. So now you can see that it's auto cropped for this whole thing, and now I can move this to just include my page, which is great. So you can, um, you can adjust where you want it to scan, um, and choose only that, which is pretty cool. Again, you're going to be check marking and adding photos until we get to the end. There we go. Check mark again. And we've got two more pages. As you can see, it's super user friendly. Um, you just point and shoot. You want to make sure that you have good lighting, but even if you have bad lighting, uh, cam scanner still does a pretty good job of getting it all on page. Um, so that is the last page of my uh, document. So I hit the check box in the bottom right corner again, and now it is done. So you can see that it's currently named new doc 2019-03-25. So if I click that, I can rename it to algebra. How do you spell algebra? Algebra. Uh, assignment one and hit okay so now it's got this nice name and what you can see oh it didn't change oops did I might have missed the save but this is how you rename it hit the okay button there we go now it's called algebra assignment one and then in that top right corner um, there's the dot 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 and then you're going to want to email it to myself. So that's what you click. You will email it to your email and once you have it in your email, then you're able to save it to your desktop or your school folder, wherever you have that. And then you can drag and drop it into the course submission. So it really is this simple. This is how you create a PDF um, using this awesome feature. Um, you can see I've got two of the same assignments here, but, um, as you, uh, start using cam scanner, it just saves all your documents. So you can, you know, save your assignment, um, once it's all done, um, or maybe you're working on a test or a note package or lessons or practice questions, whatever it might be. So it's a really great tool. Um, if you have any questions about cam scanner, don't hesitate to ask them. Uh, I'd love to help you out and enjoy. Have a great time in the course.